Previously on that lazy gaming channel. What happened? Turns out there was a sinkhole that opened up when a pillar collapsed in the mines in the hill. Jeez. Yep, no one could see it because of the grass. Her name was Jenny. This is Jenny's field. They never found her. Just. Gone. Ah! What's wrong? I thought it was a sinkhole thing! Hmm, how about that? Yep. I should come out here more often. <laughs> yeah. Don't look at him. Who? There's someone standing behind us. In the trees. Holy shit. Holy shit! And now back to my lazy gaming channel. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Longest Night. The first night at the woods. It's so loud! Ah! Hang on. Sorry. Turn that down. There we go. Alright. The first supplemental game for Night in the Woods. Let's start. I need to turn it down a little bit more. Arr, mm -hmm, sorry. That should be good. A little too quiet. <laughs> I'm indecisive. There we go. That should be good. Why aren't I cold? Fire! We have a fire! We have reached that level as a civilization. Oh. I'm bored. Feels like we've been here forever. Oh, we should do the longest night constellation thing. Wow, really? I haven't done that since I was like six. No one has done that since we were like six. Well, I don't remember being six. Really? Really? Yeah, I don't remember much before, like, eight and a half. That's very specific. B is a synthetic life form, created at age 8.5. This makes so much sense. Beep boop B. One, one, zero, one, one, okay, whatever, I'm done. Can we just do this thing? None of us knows enough about the constellation to even do it, Bay. Ah, God damn it. Yeah, B. I do. Since when? Since always. Now listen up, dummies. We're going to school. Space school! I can't see anything. We're pattern finders. Find some patterns. What the heck is going on? Ah, there we go. Rubello, Pope sometime in the 1400s. Crazy times. Oh god, I love this one. There, there were like two rival popes, and Rubello won by opening his mouth and consuming them with fire. And then he ate them. What? Blah! I knew that one! That is amazing. I mean, historically, his extended family poisoned one and stabbed the other before throwing him into a canal. But he did eat them. He did eat them, yes. That is the raddest thing I have ever heard. Chomp, chomp, whoops, I ate you, now I'm the Pope. I don't know what... I, I forgot what my voice for B is. Uh. Oh, there we go. Corvin, the thief. Stole the diamond from the crown of Rubello, the fire-breathing pope. Got arrowed to death like 200 feet from the palace. So he didn't get to be a consolation for being a great thief then. He did not. Screw the man! Steal the diamonds! Ah yes, the revolutionary zeal of kids from the suburbs. Possum Springs isn't the suburbs. Yeah, you need a city to have suburbs. We're in the dead center of nowhere. It's like a 40 minute drive if you want to buy shoes. Also, I'm 21. I'm not a kid. I think you're younger than me. I'm 21 too! We both have full-time jobs! Well, as close to full-time as they can get. Before they have to start giving us health insurance. I'll be 20 in like four months! Wait a minute. This can't- This isn't real. This is why Angus said it, was a, it, had, it wasn't real. Because it wasn't! Okay, fine. You're all very serious adults. Thank you. Yes, thank you!
Harmonium, the head of the singing orders of the angels. Ugh, this one. My mom always said I looked like this one. I can see it. I sure can't. Leading so many cranky angels. Grouching hard. Across the sky. Okay. Moving on. Mundy, the world fish. Back then they thought whales were fish. And you know, that the world was on one. Mundy is my sign. Oh god. Of course it is. Hey, what does that mean? Um... I don't know what, I don't know what that is. Well, if any of this meant anything, then it might mean something, but it doesn't. So... it doesn't. I don't get what's going on here. What are you doing? Whale noises. Oh. I'm not gonna do whale noises. What do you take me for? Tomatron! It rings at the end of the world. And Mundy shakes everything off her back. And I think it all catches fire, too. It all made sense back then. Back when people were, like, wicked dumb. Yeah, I don't mean to sound like a jerk, but people were super dumb back then. It's all relative. And full of dumb people. Beautiful dumb people. Oh. A fish! And... Just a fish. Pretty self-explanatory. Huh. Fun fact, fish is my sign. I think that means you're adaptable and smelly. Got one of those right, huh, Cap'n? Got a manly musk going here. You smell like that stuff I got you, finally. Ice hawk. It has a picture of an ice hawk on it. I smell quite masculine. Like an ice hawk. I think you smell nice, Angus. Thanks. What's an ice hawk? It's an ice hawk, I guess. get what I'm supposed to be doing here. Uh, this is strange. There we go. Inventorus, the inventor of music. Nice beak. Reminds me of Germ. <laughs> Germ isn't even musical. Like at all. Germ? Like Germ? Weird Germ? Yes. How do you know? I think May's getting sleepy. Um, Kanoa, or Quinoa, or Quinona, <laughs> executed by some king somewhere. Her head continued to speak against her murderers for years. That's pretty sweet. Ugh, you'd think, right? But in the story, she's portrayed as annoying. Like she was being a martyr? About literally being martyred. They eventually put her head in a trunk and threw it in a river. What did she do? It talked, out loud, in public. Oh, is that all? That was enough, apparently. Supposedly, if you put your head underwater in some river in Italy, she'll tell you about her murder. They renamed it the River of Guilt. But not like the guilt of her murderers. More like she's giving you a guilt trip or something stupid. This constellation is garbage. Chop my head off, I'll bite yours off. Happy longest night, everybody! Moving on... What I can tell, longest night. Longest night is kind of like an equinox or, or solstice, I guess. Lucio. Ah, oh, yeah. What? Lucio the fox. Scourge of the French countryside. Yeah, totally French. Totally a scourge. Why does he have a spear through him? The candle that burns twice as bright gets speared through the guts. Beautiful. You can see why this one is so popular. Marmando, Marmanodes, the little king. He was, um, a king who was little? I don't know anything about this one. 
Apparently, a little king was big news back then. I didn't think he was even supposed to be even that small. Or all that small. Stop the presses! So there's this king, right? Uh, but get this, he's slightly smaller than you'd expect. He wears small shoes! Let's immortalize him in the night sky! I'm kinda short. May Borowski, Constellation! Nah. Everyone who picked the Constellations is dead now. Ebon, the first singer. Ever see the opera based on this? Oh yeah! We watched it when we were Mr. Omer's without sick those two weeks. It's like super long. There's an awesome part where Ebon drinks the ocean and make the fish cry. So he can finally hear their voices and teach them to sing. That is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Yeah, but it's the good kind of dumb. Opera is kind of like that all over. The Mice Riders, inventors of written language. Weren't there supposed to be thousands of them? Listen, there's only so much sky. The Mice Riders are my sign. I think that means you're thousands of geniuses. I think that means you're thousands of geniuses. Why am I talking with this voice? <clears throat> Accurate. The Broken Snake, the first thing that talked. This, this story has always made me so annoyed. I was totally a kid in Sunday school who pitched a fit over this story. Oh my god, I remember that. You got sent out to the adult church to sit with your parents. No punch and cookies for me. Wow, I certainly missed out on all of that. No, oh, dude, you didn't even. And that's it, apparently. Well, that's all 13 of them. Yay, thanks, Angus. That was pretty great. You're a big old nerd, Captain. Yes. Yes, I am. You should be a professor. I like to think I fill that role at the video store. Well, I should probably get home. Wait. I just realized that I haven't hung out with you in years, B. What? Yeah, not since, like, 7th grade? I remember. I was there. You were a massive jerk. But why am I at a longest night bonfire with you? Because you just missed me so much? Wait, are we actually in space? But I'm warm and breathing. What am I sitting on? Tyrannosaurus pattern. What? Oh god, I haven't seen Greg or Angus for a year and a half. Regret and emptiness. I didn't go home for longest night. Laundry day. Apple juice taste from when you threw up earlier. You have to call home. You don't want to call home. It's too late to take the bus. What made you think of me today? You don't want to take the bus. This is your new life. Is it still new after a year and a half? Underwear adjust. Next year will be new again. Next year will be new again. Leg stretch! Oh, come on. This is getting stupid. Am I seriously... Well, home's not gonna call itself. It was all a dream! Well, that was a thing. Oh my god, it crashed! <laughs> Alright! Well, next time we'll play the actual game! That was weird. Adios!